We good? Yep, you guys are good to go. Okay. Ethan, finally, right? How good does it finally feel to get that last hurdle and cross it and get that goal tonight? Yeah, it feels good. Um, obviously, it's not all about scoring goals, but it's one of my job or part of my job to produce. And so um, that little rut I was in, um, it obviously wasn't very fun, but it feels good to get the win tonight. Riley, can you talk about just what it took in the overtime from you guys? I mean, after they kind of came back and tied it late, but it took from you guys in overtime to pull this out? Yeah, we talked in the room. Um, you know, we said to regroup and um, continue to play our game. Uh, I think they, they really took it to the first part of overtime. So, um, you know, I think obviously capitalizing was big for our team. Ethan, uh, kind of what has the last six weeks or so been like just mentally kind of going through these ups and downs after such a good, good rookie season? Uh, lots of learning. You know, everybody's everybody kind of goes through it sooner or later in their career. And so just finding that even ground and not being too low or getting too high is, is big. And um, the support that I had in the, in the locker room was, was big for that. And what, what has Todd kind of been telling you throughout this whole time? Um, don't worry about anything but playing hard and playing Bears hockey. Everything else will follow through and um, it finally worked. So it feels good. How important do you guys think a win in this environment at home kind of resets the mentality of this team? Uh, I mean, obviously, uh, they you know took care of what they needed to at home in two games, and uh, tonight, you know, I mean, if you know anything about hockey, a seven-game series is kind of a must-win game for us. So, I mean, as the roller coaster of a game, you know, we, we kind of had it in the bag and let it slip away in the third there. Um, you know, we knew if we wanted to have a you know legitimate chance of winning the series, we had to figure out a way to get it done. So, I mean, props to the guys for uh, you know offensively tonight they're really good. So it was. You know, a good step in the right direction. You know, looking forward to the rest of the series. Riley, Nelly talked about he's expecting this to be uh, a better Coachella next next game. Do you have to step it up a notch in Game Four? Are there things that you think you want to clean up in this one? Obviously, great to have the win, but how do you how do you take it from the Game Four? Yeah, obviously um, they're going to be bringing their best. We're going to be bringing ours, but um, we'll have to go over film the next couple of days and see things we have to correct and go from there. But uh, I think there's a lot of positives on our team's behalf tonight that we can build off of moving forward. I think this is the first time you guys probably felt some desperation in this whole postseason to come out of it the way you did. I mean, is that a positive for you guys? Yeah, I think so. Um, I mean, like you said, throughout the season, we didn't really have to go through it all that often. And, um, you know, it's the first time in a while we've had to do it. So. I think this shows the character we have in the room, and um, hopefully, we can continue to do that. Good. All right, thank you, everybody. Here.